Goldman Sachs comes, Morgan Stanley comes to hire, JP Morgan comes to hire. A lot of people ask me this question, whether quant finance is a career which they can get into after studying MSQE from Indian Statistical Institute. Now MSQE, the name kind of makes you feel like that because MSQE means Masters in Science and Quantitative Economics. But the truth is that quantitative economics and quantitative finance are different in a lot of aspects. And a lot of people, they don't understand that what quantitative finance as an industry is, is mostly programming for financial applications. And that is the best explanation which I can think of. If you think that quant finance is a career which you'll get into easily after getting into MSQE, then you are mistaken. Because after you get into MSQE, there are a lot of other career options which you are more likely to get into. If you really are interested in quant finance, either try to think of master's or PhD from outside India or either get into an MBA from I am Ahmedabad or I am Calcutta or even I am Lucknow for that matter. The idea is you have to get into the top B schools or get into the best of uh, finance economics degrees in, in, in the world. The batch strength at ISI is very small, plus the flagship program of ISI is MSTAT, not MSQE. So a lot of company come to hire the MSTAT folks, not QE folks. So quant economics will not get you quant finance job at ISI. What it will give you definitely is some chance of getting to a mathematical kind of a role in a financial firm, maybe a credit risk kind of a role. Generally, that's not really quant finance because how people think of quant finance as someone in their teens or in early 20s is they will trade and they will use maths to trade. Now, that kind of quant finance is very rare. And as I said, you have to either be outside of India in a master's or a PhD program or you have to graduate from the top B schools in India. That is how you can get those trading kind of a job. But that then also the level of math in that might be very limited. Now, <clears throat> to answer your question, can I get into a finance career after MSQE? So I, I'm saying that it's not that common, not that obvious, but obviously I can't rule that out because maybe one or two people will get such kind of a role in maybe two to three years of gap. So yes, Goldman Sachs comes, Morgan Stanley comes to hire, JP Morgan comes to hire. But these roles are not really quant finance roles. These are more like data science in banking roles and credit risk kind of roles. So the reason I'm describing quant finance as different from these roles is because a lot of people, when they talk about quant finance, they are actually talking, talking about uh, quantitative trading, algorithmic trading. So that's something which you're more like to, likely to get into if you are in a CS department at top IIT and that too in a bachelor's BTEC program. And uh, yes, I have few biases here why I'm saying this because I also have limited data and limited awareness. But having studied at an IIT, having studied at an ISI, having seen through the placement reports, I now have a sense of how you get into different kinds of roles. So if you really are interested in quant finance, then MSQE from ISI might not be the best option for you. But I must assure you that no matter what kind of job you will get after your MSQE, that will have a good kind of an analytical rigor. Because understand most companies come there to hire MSTAT folks. So that's a good externality.